Hey, Boo Crew, we are back with entry number 21 in the Bag Topper Swap. And this is from Natalie, who is Chunky Paper Layers. And look at, just look at this packaging. She's made little mini albums. She has them decorated with this nice floral die cut on the top. And look, uh oh, I got it backwards. They all say Bag Toppers OMG. And she made me one. This is beautiful, Natalie. Oh, I cannot wait to dive in. And so, yes, um, I will open this and I will be right back. Okay, we're back. Look at the cohesiveness of this. The, the card that she, she gave me and the mini album itself. Natalie, this is gorgeous. So it looks like she has embossed the word, a little note, big thanks on this die cut, which is a mailbox overflowing with flowers and mail. That is so cute. She has this scalloped square layering piece on top of a black base layer and it's on a white cardstock. And yeah, that's that's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And she just wrote me a note and gave me her shipping. Thank you for joining, dear. That's an amazing card. You should have joined the card swap. You still got time. September 1st. Get 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 some get five cards in it. <laughs> so look at this. So she has this flower cluster on the top. That is beautiful. So it looks like she has some tool underneath. The word bag topper. So let's dive in. Oh, she's got it tied into a bow to keep these together. Miss Chunky Paper Layers. Oh, look it. So this one says, hey, crafty friends. So we have two Polaroids with the word, hey, crafty friend on it. She has two flags coming out the back, some scissors, and a stitch circle in the back, and some flowers, some flat flowers. Those are adorable little flowers. What dye is that? Now, you got to tell me. So she just used some solid cardstock. It's more like a salmon color. Very cute. And look at the scissors. Oh, <laughs> love it then she's made this one with a snowman and he's melting it's like a she's like an ice cream cone let it snow that is adorable so she's embossed the back of this paper and it looks like i can't tell what it is it looks like piping bags almost if you guys can see kind of looks like a piping bag yeah, I think that's a good angle to see it. But that's amazing. That's gorgeous. She has this nice little bow up, up top with a heart on it. Nice touch. So that could be considered her heart. And she also has a heart on here. So it looks like she has hearts on all of them. So thank you for that, Nat. <laughs> then we have this Halloween one. It says boo. So she's used the conversation heart that says boo. It has black glitter in the back. She has a glittered spider web in the back. And this is um, a shopping bag. A shopping bag bag cut. The ghost is coming out of it. She has some shred. Looks just like a present. She has some flax coming out and two glittered bats. That is so cute. And, she, you know, no pattern paper. She just layered it up. True to her name. Chunky paper layers. <laughs> I love that. That's so adorable. I cannot wait to use that this season as well as these. And then this one's warm and cozy. And it has a cup of cocoa with marshmallows in it. And I'm assuming this is like a snow heel and it's white glitter. Let's see if you guys can see that. It's not translating well. My lights are so bright, <laughs> but I need to be able to see. So, yeah, but just know it's glitter. <laughs> it's white glitter. And then this warm and cozy is in a light blue. And then this is a beautiful blue color. I, I don't it's not like navy. Hmm. I'm not sure. Well, yeah, it's more navy. It's more navy in the back. I can tell now. It's, now I see it in the back. It's more navy. Adorable. But look at this mini oven. You can reuse this. After you've removed uh, everything out of it, and, and oh, this is cute, girl. You got to give me a tutorial for that. Oh, wow. And so we have two boxes over here. Let's see what's inside. Oh, Nat! And she's cut sh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven plain back toppers for you to alter yourself. That is so sweet. Thank you, dear. This is so helpful. You just don't know to just... Have it already die cut and all you have to do is embellish it. Thank you so much. That is so kind of you. And that took a lot of time. I appreciate you. And then she's gifted you the die cuts and embellish to embellish them all. Oh, wow. So we've got some macaroons. Got some, some, um, what well, we call them skillies, but <laughs> little beanies with a little pom pom on top. She's getting some of those flowers that I just was wondering where she got. And now I have some to use. Got some tulips. Some bunnies. Some hearts. 
some glasses. Oh, just tons of options to embellish. More flowers, an envelope, the word M for Mika. Yay! <laughs> Thank you. This is so nice. I appreciate this so much, Natalie. You did an amazing job. Someone's going to love your, your project as well. All of you. you guys have all done amazing jobs and it just makes me so happy. I know a lot of you, you know, when I said that I wanted to honor my granny, that really stuck out for you guys. And I appreciate that because we all love our grannies, you know, and they deserve the praise. They made us who we are. I mean, you know, our parents, for the most part, did it. But our grannies, those are those ones. We just had a different relationship. <laughs> So I thank you, Natalie. This was beautiful. I, oh, I cherish everything you guys have made for me. Thank you. Because you didn't have to do it. But it does make it much easier than I can keep the actual swaps intact. And I don't, I don't have to mess them up. But I do take pictures prior to so that I know how to put it back. So don't worry. Everything still looks the same. Thank you, guys. I'll be back with one more video. Thanks for tuning in.